platform. I have all the platform. Hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? With uh, a fever. You got a fever? Yeah. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Have you have you taken your temperature? Mm -hmm. Do you know how much is it? Um, it was thirty seven. Mm. Mm -hmm. Are you taking any pills? Yes, of course I have done it. And how long have you been? Uh, fever? Yesterday I began with yesterday, but now, um, I am <laughs> sweat. Estoy sudando. You're, you're sweating. Yeah, I'm sweating. Uh, uh -huh. Any yeah. other symptom? Mm, well, I I felt my throat very like estrangulada, right? But it was the um the pressure. Mm. Yeah, it was the pressure. I I took the, my pressure to pills. And, it, and, and ah yes, and I have. Uh, so you do you suffer of high blood pressure? Yeah, sometimes, sometimes. No, no, I mean, are you diagnosed? Yes, no, no, but but they say that I am not uh, hypertense. I'm, I'm not hypertense, not yet. That's what they say. Well, just be careful, okay? Because uh, it is always COVID, you know, sometimes you, don't, you just don't know. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, just be careful. Yes, thank you, teacher. You know, before I, I joined the class, I was actually studying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice. Yeah, I, I was trying to remember some words or verbs that I haven't used in a long time. Mm -hmm. Like those ones, managed, indul indulged, indulged, let me see. Indulge, indulge. indulge. See. Indulge. indulge, indulge. Oh, bail out. There's another one. Bail out, bail out. And I don't remember what is it. Hmm. To bail out. Film business or economy to save it from collapse. An act of giving financial assistance. To, oh, okay. It's a synonym of rescuing to bail out. Um, the way I'm doing this is going through Juglish. Have you heard of Juglish.com? I think I mentioned it to you before. Mm, no, I haven't. Uh, you haven't? I haven't? <laughs> no, I haven't heard it. Uh, Juglish.com. Uh, it's very useful. Juglish. Oh, Juglish.com. Uh, it's just one word. You cannot introduce a sentence, just a word. If you want to know how to pronounce it, like comfortable, for example, uh -huh. which is not a common word and is very. Actually, there are two different pronunciations for comfortable. Comfortable, yeah. <laughs> so, mm. comfortable comfortable mm -hmm. comfortable 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 and some people say comfortable com comfortable comfortable mm -mm. i mean yeah, yes comfortable. Mm -hmm. yeah they, they can do it you know british actually do it oh yes of course Hold on. British people <laughs> do comfortable, <laughs> comfortable, comfortable. I don't know. It's it's difficult. So the the way I'm doing this is that I think about a difficult word, and then I just go to Yuglish, find it, and then and then I find all their words. Yes, that I didn't um, know, but but the uh, point is the point is to understand the word yeah. mm -hmm. in context. Don't translate it. Mm -hmm. Just get it in context. And do you know what is the meaning of palindrome? Huh? 
Palindrome. Palindrome. Can you spell it or type it? Okay, I will try type it. Okay. Yeah, type it on the chat. Uh, palindrome. Ba palindrome. Mm -hmm. Oh, palindrome. Yeah. No. Sounds a. Uh, uh, uh... I like a sickness, right? Yeah, yeah. Not even in Spanish. I don't know what it is. What is it? A oh. word, phrase, or sequence that reads the same. Oh, okay. That <laughs> <laughs> hmm. reads the same backwards and forward. Mm -hmm. There's a name for that in, in Spanish. Hmm. Oh. What could they say here? Hmm? Um, I will look. I will look into this. I don't know. Palindromos. Palindrome. Palindrome. Palindromo. <laughs> what yeah, palindrome is, in <laughs> Spanish? <laughs> Even in Spanish, I understand the meaning. I never heard. Yeah, it's funny. Bob, Otto, Anina, Asisa, Ojo, Oso, Ojo, Ceres, Arenera, Sometemos, Somos. Wow. <laughs> I don't know I can find if I can find English words. <laughs> that's funny hey that's a good one i learned something oh mom dad mm. Mm. Mom? lol <laughs> lol <laughs> lol <laughs> laugh no laugh, laugh. Mm -mm. no laugh out loud laughing yeah. out loud laughing out loud laughing out yeah. loud out loud oh mm -hmm. oh well someone told me lot of laughs <laughs>, from the laughs. Mm -hmm. nothing out loud yeah that's interesting very interesting hey eh? thank you thank you i'll study that later palindromes okay, okay. so where were we um i don't have here um <laughs> Okay. No, we were speaking about I had uh, I had gone to school, uh, well, I mean to college, be and before going to school, but but before I went to school. Okay, yeah, it's an action that happened before another action in the past. That is correct. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. Sorry. Um, Okay, so uh, let's continue with the examples. So yesterday I gave you, I just gave you a little introduction on how to do this, but it, it shouldn't have to be that difficult. And the grammar is the simplest thing you can use. Uh, so we said positive, negative, and questions. Let, let's use questions now because we haven't done it. Um, so let's try it. Uh, give me, oh, well, let me use this word because I want because I want you to use this verb in a different context. Mm -hmm. What is the what is the meaning of this verb, Walter or someone? I have a control uh, over things, over actions. Oh, good! You have control yeah. over things or actions. Yeah, as yeah. a verb, that's what it is, right? To yeah. control, have control. Okay, over something or someone. Okay, what word could we use with manage? Management, an enterprise. Hmm. Management. Uh, management. Administration. Is a noun. Administration. What can you manage? What about, think about a difficult word. I'm thinking about ah, cravings. <laughs> yeah, cravings. 
Whoops. You should know this word, Sandra. No. I should. Yeah. Are you a mother? Uh, what? Are you a no, mother? No, no, I'm not mother. You're not a mother? No. You have no kids? No, I don't. <gasps> so you don't know what is a craving. Okay. I don't know. Thanks, God. <laughs> guys, guys. Well, Jancy, you're a mother, right? Do you have kids? Yes. <laughs> you know what are cravings? I don't know. What does it mean? What does it mean? When, when you're pregnant. Oh, um, uh, wishes, like a wish. Oh, like strong, strong wish. desires. Strong desires, you know, and sometimes odd, sometimes odd desires. What is odd, teacher? Outward, um, outward desires. Our desires. Outward desire. Hey, desire. you're learning vocabulary with me. That I love that. Okay. Yes, that is odd. Yeah. Strong desires. Odd desires. Odd okay. is, is like a rare, right? Like odd. rare. Raro. Oh, <laughs> rare. 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 There you go. Rare. Uh huh. And what also was... rare. 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 Rare, rare desires, rare desires. Rare hey, uh, that, that was a nice band, Rare Earths. Rare no. Earths. No. Do you know idea who's Rare Earths? No. Really? Come on, guys. I, I'm younger than you. You, sh <laughs> you don't know about Rare <laughs> Earths. Uh, stranger. No stranger. <laughs> stranger. <laughs> yeah, I know. Rare is weird, outward. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, odd is a synonym of, of rare or, or weird. Mm -hmm. But I mean, teacher, but in, in math, odd is uh, impaired. What do you mean impair? Impair. Oh. A number. Oh, ampere? An impair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Impair. Uh, yeah, that could be one. Okay, so let's make a sentence in positive, negative, and question using manage and cravings. Who can do it? Saul, would you like to? Miguel, someone who hasn't spoken? Earth is, is tierra extraña. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not plural, it's singular, rare earth. Let, let yeah. me, oh, 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 the most popular song. Man, the most popular song. Uh, 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 yeah. I, oh, did you hear it? Yeah. I like it. Sounds, sounds good. <laughs> I was a chiquitita. I don't remember how to sing that song. I remember the parties in the childhood. In, 19, the in 1987. 1959, actually. No. <laughs> that was good. 1959 to 1971. Oh, I was. Motown. Hey, that, that, that's crazy. Oh, my God. Yeah, you just made me remember a great band. Okay, so let's see. Manage. Cravings. Cravings. Come up with a sentence using past perfect. Come on. Manage and cravings. Okay. It's so simple. <laughs> it's so simple. Managed. I have managed some fear. Huh? I think miles. I had managed and I uh, some, some feel some feel? feelings fee. fee fee uh like a tax like a tax. No, use the words on the top. Manage cravings. Oh <laughs> in past perfect, yeah. Yeah. She okay. had craving or craving uh, mm. of chicken, for example. Oh, but that is not past perfect. Let's see. I oh, hold on. Yeah, you said yeah. she had uh what what did you say? Chicken? Chicken. Let's say fried chicken. chicken. Right, the chicken. Cravings. What are the cravings fried. of? Oh, mm. fried chicken. She had fried chicken cravings. Cravings. Would you like to? Would you like to 
to be more specific, she had strong or she had this strong fried chicken cravings all the time. That's why you have chicken face, son. <laughs> I'm sorry. All the time, that's why. You don't get it. It's all the time. Ella tenía este fuerte deseo de pollo frito todo el tiempo. Por eso es que tú tienes cara de pollo, hijo. Chicken face. I never went for the fried chicken. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's my fault. <laughs> you know the saying, right? Ya saben el dicho, right? Sí. Vas, vas a salir con cara de lo que deseas el niño. Si no, te lo, no se lo conseguís a la, a la mujer con esa embarazada. Nunca había oído eso. I never listened to si quiere camote, tráele camote en dulce. Oh my god, no. Por qué? Come on, guys. So, this is not present perfect. Oh, no. Oh, there it is. Okay. That wasn't past perfect. Come on. I tried to turn. Yes, please. Let me... No, past perfect. I'm sending the example to the chat. Go ahead. Okay. When she was praying that. She always had a craving for mangoes. Oh, good. When she was pregnant, that's the context. Yeah. Very good. Uh -huh. a, a, a situation in the past. Okay. Yeah. When she was oh, pregnant. pregnant, pregnant, she, she always. Oh no, had... that's, this this is not past perfect. Had Why? she always had this not past perfect? Um, she always had this craving for what? Mango? Mangoes, yeah. She always had these cravings for mango, tierno, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> she had, hey, she always had this. Very good. This is simple fast. Yes, yes. Simple fast. Yes, it's simple fast. Mm, it's a pass of hard. Yeah, okay, yeah. I don't want to give you an example. You you need to, to land the idea. Okay. Come on. But let me see who hasn't spoken. Karen Rodriguez. Good evening, Eunice. Eunice, you're too quiet. Roberto. Da Daniela. Yeah. You know what? If your camera is off, I'm going to say your name. Uh -huh. Wendy Goches. So the verb is manage. The word is I'm craving. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Wendy, good evening. So again, guys, remember really? subject plus had Ooh. plus past participle of the verb plus the complement. Am, am I right? Am I missing something? No, right. Okay, let's go with a positive, an affirmation. Uh, Wendy Goches, your verb is manage. And the word is craving. Cravings. Mm -hmm. My bear is manage. And my, yeah. and my what? And your word oh is craving, cravings. That's just a, a word. Only That's word. a word. Yeah, it's a word. Okay. You know how uh, when you're when you're pregnant, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, I, um, hmm. I nope. haven't, I haven't managed the craving of my sister. Uh, but you couldn't manage someone else's. I haven't managed. Can you manage someone else's feelings? <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, well, women, women do, yeah. does. Women do this all yes. the time with husbands, right? La mujer no controla los sentimientos. It's true. That's true. Okay. Uh, well, I had it uh, managed. Managed. My sisters. The craving of my of my sister cravings. Uh -huh. Cravings. Don't hurt. I hadn't managed my sister's cravings. 
Okay, uh, again, is this part perfect? Yes. 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 You're following, I, I like it. I like it. You're following the structure now. Let's nice. put it in context. What is the context? <laughs> so. She was pregnant. I'm sorry. By she the time. <laughs> by the yeah. time your mom. No, 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 no. No, uh, my sister. Uh, At the time, my sister was by, pregnant. By the time she was ready to deliver, I hadn't managed my sister Cravens. Does this make sense? Yeah. By the time she was ready to deliver, I hadn't managed yeah. my sister's Cravens. That's, and by the way, you made that's a negative. I say. <laughs> you made a negative. Okay, perfect. So, um, hmm. I haven't uh -huh. managed. Now, a positive sentence in this case yes. with present perfect will be just removing the negative. In this example, you can simply remove the negative. So by the time she was ready to deliver, let's put a comma here. I had managed my sister. I managed craving. my sister craving. Okay. Now, how would okay. you make a question? Have you managed? How do you do it? Yes, how you have how I managed my sister craving by the time she was ready to the delivery. Excellent. Okay, yeah, you can turn the tortilla around and say this. I, <laughs> I had oh had you right. Had oh. I managed had I uh-huh um, so reflective question. Had I managed my sister's managed my cravings, sister cravings by the time by the time she was ready to the delivery. Mm -hmm. And the time she was ready to deliver. There you go. By the time. Yes, I have one. Sir. Almost there. Hold on. And lastly, an open question. How had I managed my sister's cravings by the time she was ready to deliver? Well, I, I actually uh, knew what she liked, you know, so I was able to manage do you understand that? A reflective question? Una pregunta reflexiva. Right? ¿Cómo logré ¿Cómo? A ver. ¿Cómo había logrado controlar wow. los deseos de mi hermana para cuando ya estaba lista para dar a luz? Bueno, eh, ya se la, la conocía, o so ya sabía que era lo que quería cada momento le miraba la cara y era como que ah querés frijoles molidos Ay. sí ahorita ahorita okay I had eaten my <laughs> I don't know I'm just thinking hey did you like this so esto es lo que ustedes tienen que estar haciendo a este punto todavía tienen que estar haciendo este ejercicio así como yo se los he pintado lunes hago pasado perfecto martes uh -huh. hago presente perfecto miércoles hago pasado simple okay Eh, solo es una sugerencia, es una dieta que yo siempre yes. recomiendo, porque lo que no se está utilizando se arruina. Yeah. Ok, ahorita les envío esto. Que... Uh, son varios verbos que no hemos utilizado. Que no Excelente, sabemos. muy bien. Ya. Yeah. I have, a, yes, I have an a sentence teacher. An example? Yes, she hadn't managed why she had those craving desires until she had gone to see the doctor and he told her to be pregnant. She told her she was. To, uh -huh. to be pregnant. And she told her she was pregnant. I uh, got your, your idea and that, that sounds very natural. Yeah. So she hadn't... Mm, can you repeat it one more time? <laughs> okay. Slow, slow, she slow. Hadn't, she hadn't managed why she had those cravings, desires, until she had gone to see the doctor and he told her to be pregnant. Hmm. Okay, did you get it, guys? No? Okay, first, Sandra said she hadn't managed uh -huh. th these desires, this... Why she had those cravings? Oh, oh uh -huh. why, why? She uh -huh. had this, uh, those. 
Those cravings. Craving. You don't need to say desires. Those cravings. So she hadn't managed why she had this, those, those uh -huh. cravings. Those cravings. Uh -huh. Until she had gone to see Until the doctor. She I have went. a question. Teacher. Until she went. Ah, uh, she went. Yeah, it was an action in the past. Okay. It Until finished. she went to see the doctor and he told her that she uh -huh. was pregnant. Mm -hmm. And he told it's her. True. Right now, right now, she was pregnant. Or, and she realized she was pregnant. Okay, go ahead. Uh, Joaquin, girl, I believe. Think. Miguel? Yes. No? Yeah, Joaquin. I have a question, no. okay. uh, have a question teacher. Mm -hmm. um, uh, grab, uh, grabbing, grabbing is, is um, uh, synonymous uh, of uh, the wishes. Big wishes, no strong desires. Look at the look at the WhatsApp. I send you I send you the um, the exercise we were doing. Okay, quiero aclarar algo. Sure. En un sure. estudiante sure. básico, ahorita Miguel, Miguel Antonio, ahorita te doy yeah. chance porque necesito escuchar que me quieres decir también. Pero rápido, rápido, antes de que se me haga la idea. Ese cuadrito que les envié en el WhatsApp, yo en los estudiantes de básico les digo, agarré una un verbo, le ponen el significado en español. Una palabra relacionada a ese verbo, ¿sí? Y le pones el significado en español. Y empezás, positivo o negativo, pregunta, y llevas una. Ahora, haces ese ejercicio cinco veces al día. Y según Pareto, se te van a quedar dos verbos y dos palabras automáticamente, sin esfuerzo. ¿Ya? Es una cosa programada. Claro, no te vas a quedar con eso en cinco minutos. Lo haces, no. Repetir, repetir, repetir. Ok. Eh, en su caso, ya no ocupo español. Sino que, como hizo, hizo Joaquín ahorita, cravings, strong desires, right? Strong wishes. Strong pero, wishes. pero un wish, eh, un wish es un deseo, o sea, es un noun. ¿Y querés, querés usar sinónimos para explicar un verbo o una palabra? Hmm. Strong desires for something. Ok. You got it. Miguel, go ahead. Uh, why are you using why in this? sentence and not use <laughs> you got it okay <laughs> siguiente módulo supongo because bueno, dentro de poco vas a ver si te lo, te lo, perdón que les hable en español yo sé pero es muy importante que, que no me tome mucho tiempo en eso si no nos vamos a, a echar toda la hora en esto hay cláusulas dependientes y cláusulas independientes o oh, son temas muy fumados pero si sí los vas a ver acá en inglés corporativo um, <laughs> Por ejemplo, lo que has visto en este ejemplo que yo les envié ahorita en WhatsApp. By the time she was ready to deliver. ¿Tendría sentido si yo solo te digo para cuando ya estaba lista para dar a luz? ¿Para cuando ya estaba lista para dar a luz? ¿Te quedas? Sí, ah. perdido. Ajá, ¿qué pasó? ¿Qué pasa cuando ya estaba? ¿Qué pasó cuando ya estaba lista? Ya, esa es una cláusula dependiente. Tan simple como eso, depende de otra idea. Otra action. Yeah. And, sin embargo, la independiente sería, I had managed my sister's cravings. Yeah. Esa podría ser independiente si se está en el contexto de la conversación, ¿sí o no? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ok, y luego verán ese tema, ¿sí? Por eso, Miguel, ahora, dentro de tu pregunta, ok, ese why solo es un conector de por qué. Ella tenía, ¿Por qué pero, ella tenía este, estos deseos? No es una pregunta, teacher. Sí, no. Pero, ajá, es, cuando, cuando no es pregunta que no comienza, se ocupa el because. Entonces, mm -hmm. la pregunta es por, por qué utiliza el why. A, a, a ver, Sandra. Uh, because uh, it is the connector. It's like when, you, when we say that or when or something like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. O sea, no, no vas a decir for that o because. Sino que es una pregunta sin ser una pregunta. Entender el por qué. To understand, to, to understand why of things. Okay? It's important to understand the why of things. En lugar de decir the reason of things. Uh, the why of things. Could be. You don't say the, the because of things. Es como cuando decís... Y esto lo viví. Tuve una, una alumna en avanzado 6, avanzado 6 en el programa de inglés para el trabajo. Um, 
hey, how do you feel today? Y me decía, how do you feel today? Uh, are you okay? Le decía. Y me decía, if teacher, if. <laughs> and I was like, and I, and I was like, okay. Yeah. Listen, you don't say yeah. if. You say yes. Yes. Oh, okay. If, if teacher. No, no. Yes. <laughs> that was, that was, that was if, difficult. If yeah. is for the conditional, right? Yeah, exactly. That is a conditional. Very good. So, what about you, this, Mister? Can see, huh? I have managed manage a business in 1999 when my sister asked me to manage her business. Hmm. What do you think, guys? Is that perfect? Okay. Is that perfect. perfect? I had managed a bis my business. A business. A business. Uh huh. In 1999. In 1999. Okay. When my sister asked me mm -hmm. to manage her business. Mm -hmm. Business. Okay, guys. What do you think? I had managed a business in 1999 when my sister asked me to manage her business. No. Just ask me. I think it's fine. Yeah. It is it's okay. A it's a present perfect um, sentence. Perfect. I'm sorry, a past perfect sentence. Yes. Perfect. Yeah. That now this action is not being stopped by the past action. It's just a situation that happened before another one in the yeah. past. Past sentence. Like a possibility. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -mm. This had happened Happy. before something else happened. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mr. Pass. I had I had I had fell in love. I had fell in love with my wife before I knew before I met her. I had fell oh in love God. with my with my wife before I met her. Mm -hmm. And I didn't know. Before how do you say how do you say como así teacher? How do you say como así in English? <laughs> how do you say como así in English? Come on. How come? How come? Hey, how come? Good. How come? Who how said come? it? Yeah. Who said yeah. it? How come? How come? Yeah, see, I, I Wendy. See <laughs> Wendy, good. Good job. How come? <laughs> how combo? <laughs> in Salvadorian, how combo? <laughs> Mm. Falta el bohom, right? <coughs> no, mentira. Okay, how come? La primera vez que yo escuché esto de un profesor, <coughs> me quedé, I was like, what? what? How come? How come? What is that? What is how come? Because I learned by myself, right? Remember, so that was, that was it. <laughs> easy. Okay, so how come? I don't know. I was just making up a, a phrase, but it's true. I had, I had fell in love with my wife before I met her. Because when I saw her for the first time, I remember. I remember when I saw her for the first time. She was my boss. She was my boss. <laughs> yeah. <Really? laughs> yeah. And later, and later, I became Carmelo. I was Carmelo later. <laughs> <laughs> Long story short. Long story short. <laughs> phrases, phrases, someone, phrases. Someone told me that how come means why. Mm, mm -mm. No. <laughs> no. I mean, is it? It could be, you know, my sister's cousin who got married with another cousin of her. La hermana de mi prima que se casó con el hermano de la prima de la otra. Oops. Like what? What in re? Ahí, you don't say why, you say how come? How come? Como así, I say what? Right? It doesn't, it's, you need more explanation. That's the point. Okay. So I need your examples. We need to practice this. So let's go and make Positive, negative, and questions. Now, I challenged you guys to use difficult verbs, okay? 
Okay. Yes, patients. I Man, I'm very creative. I'm sorry. I'm thinking about boil. Boil. <laughs> boil. Yeah. Beans. Boil. Beans. Boil beans. Frijoles. Hervidos. <laughs> Come on. Make me a sentence. What happened? Okay. Jenny. Roberto. <laughs> Jacqueline. Martha. I, was... I had boiled. I had cooking. The beans. Hmm. So let's see. Let's see who makes the sentence. I'm gonna split you in groups, okay? And think about how how you can do that. Boil, okay? Boil and beans, okay? Now I need you to make three, okay? Three examples with positive, negative, and question in your groups. The same examples is just a collective thing, okay? The same examples for groups. You can do it, guys. Teamwork, teamwork. Cool. It is. It is difficult. Yeah. 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 I, um, I have an example about the teacher said. You know, I yeah. had pulled the beans when suddenly my friends appeared unexpectedly. <laughs> uh huh. And and how come? Uh, yeah. How come? And how come if I if I hadn't had anything to give them to eat? You know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hi, Amilcar. Amilcar, hello. Hi, hello. How are you, Amilcar? Oh, oh, oh don't do that. <laughs> right. <laughs> don't don't say hi, hello. Hey, hello. Sí, no digan hi, hello. Se dice solo hi o solo hello. Yeah. Porque en español no puedes decir hola, hola. Hola, hola, yeah. <laughs> ¿Qué onda? Es raro, de hecho, right? Uh, yeah, hey, what's yeah. up? Hey, what's up? Hello, what's up? Hi, hello. I don't know. Sounds weird. You say hi, sure. and I say hello. Mm -hmm. Hi, yeah. hello. Hello, hi. Hi. Good? I, I, I learned a, 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 a new word for me today. For example, when you say, hi, fellas. Oh, fellas, yeah, fellas. Yeah, fellas, and you like saw it, friend. and you saw it yeah. many times. You saw Porky many times, right? Yeah. Okay. Or oh, another word, folks, like synonymous is pop. Yeah, folks. Very yeah. good. Well, I remember that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, fellows are. Uh, that, 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 fellows. Oh, that's Bugs Bunny. Yeah, uh, but yeah. <laughs> that, 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 that's all, folks. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. 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 Okay. Hey, your your example, Mr. Walter. Oh my God, Mr. Ramos. I mean, uh, uh, talking about teacher. You can yeah. hear me. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> okay. I have a problem. <laughs> but it's okay. 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 It doesn't work. Okay. Uh, teacher. Tenemos que hacer tres oraciones en past perfect, but... Tres verbos and... con, su, con su palabra. Así como yo te hice el ejemplo, verbo, palabra. Okay. Positivo, negativo, pregunta. Otra. Okay. Verbo, Any verb? Palabra. Any verb. I mean, okay. yeah, but something that you have never used. Go to your WhatsApp. There you have a list yeah. of verbs. This list. Yep. Yep, that one. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. But make a decision together. See what verb you don't, nobody knows in the in the group. 
Okay. Thanks. And the three in past perfect, right? In positive, negative, and interrogative, but in past perfect. Mm -hmm. There you got it. The thing is to acquire the structure. Okay. Acquire the structure. Okay, thank yes. you, teacher. Subject plus hat plus plus participle verb plus complement. Complement, yes. Yeah. So just uh, hat plus uh, participle uh, and complement. Uh, what verb? Spanish is como yo había. Yep. Ah, okay. El hat is como había. Indo. Como un pasado, pero más en el pasado. <laughs> okay. Yeah. What verb do you think? Okay, I I had yes. I had blue a lot of balloons. I, I tried, I try, I can, I can, okay, um, I had I try. Mm. I had dreamed that I was famous, F famous, famous. In the negative, uh, I ha had not or hadn't dreamed that I was famous. Oh, and I'm sorry, yeah, it's blown. Remember, you're using the participle of the verb. Um, I just send you the structure um, to your WhatsApp. Okay. That's what we're doing, positive, okay. negative, question. Positive, oh, yes, yes. Work, work together, but select the, the verbs. Try to find difficult verbs. Three. Okay. For example, yeah, cling, clung, clung. Wow, that's odd. Okay. When my girlfriend said me that she doesn't like beans. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, the second example, I hadn't boiled beans when my siblings came home and they were very hungry. Oh, okay. Uh, wait, so, wait, wait. Uh, the beans hadn't boiled. Oh, <laughs> the beans okay. hadn't boiled. Right. Oh, okay. Teacher, 
I do two egg, two example, and I wanna know that it's that are correct or not. You need to know if those are correct or not. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, the first one is I had to boil the beans because they were going bad. Mm, okay. Hey, that, that's a nice sentence, but the, the way you made it, let's see, I had to boil the beans because they were going bad. Okay, that's that's present. Uh, that's past simple. Beans. Oh. Those were. Yo tuve uh -huh. So let's say I had, I had boiled. Oh. Uh, without the two, I had boiled the the beans. Uh -huh. I had boiled the beans because they were going bad. Okay. I had boil. Yo había hervido los frijoles porque se estaban poniendo malos. Mm -hmm. Mal. That's and the right. second one is she had boiled the beans and she forgot because she was talking to her boyfriend. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, she had she had put the, the beans to boil. She okay. had put the beans to boil. Interesting. She had put the beans to boil. No, it's okay. Yeah, I'm using had to boil. Had, okay, but interesting. You can use multiple verbs, you know, in that mm -hmm. example. Okay, yes. good job. Keep it up. Thank you. Good Keep going. <laughs> <clears throat> I have an example. Okay. Um, I had boiled boiled the water before before I get uh, I don't know what to say um, the polvo the cafe <laughs> coffee or no, only coffee I don't know. Coffee powder. Okay. Coffee powder. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the sentence is, uh, I had boiled the water before I get, oh, say I get the, the coffee. Mm -hmm. The coffee and, well, and, and powder. Powder, okay. Yes, sir. At the, hold on, at the store. Okay. Yo había hervido el agua antes de comprar. Ese God está como comprar. Mm -hmm. Antes de comprar el café en polvo en la tienda. Mm -hmm. so, oops. <laughs> Where's the coffee? Okay. <laughs> That could happen. Okay. Keep going. Keep going, guys. We're almost done. Two minutes, two minutes. Okay. I haven't taken. We have finished, teacher. They're done? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> hey. No falta in interrogate in question. Yeah, remember that you're doing positive, negative question, right? Mm -hmm. And I haven't taken the driver test. I haven't, I haven't, haven't taken, taken 
the yeah, driving driving test test okay i hadn't taken the driving test last year i hadn't taken the driver i hadn't taken the driving test last year this year i i just took it you know so i'm ready to drive and crash my car okay yeah. had you taken the driving test had you taken the driving the driving test the driving test had you taken the driving test mm -hmm. before becoming an uber <laughs> um. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> no, I haven't. Okay. All right. And the Uber answer. Have you no, finished your homework when you it. went went out to play? Come again, Daniel. Had you finished your homework when you went went out to play? Beautiful example. Had you finished? Had you finished the homework before? You went out to play. Now that's a very simple verb. Try to use something more complicated, more difficult verbs. Um, <laughs> okay, let's look at your I, examples. You, you said you were done. Come on. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Let's see the examples of everybody's. So we can put it in common. Okay, I'm all ears, I'm all ears. Okay, I'm all ears. You, shoot me your examples. I want to hear examples, examples that blew your mind away. Examples that blew your mind, something that blew your mind. Have you left? Have you left the meeting before that I arrived? Before I arrived. Good. Had had you left the meeting before I arrived? Hmm. True. That sounds right. Okay. You know what, Danielle? Select someone. Um. Joaquin Ramirez. Joaquin Ramirez. Okay, Joaquin. Mute. Okay. Okay, Joaquin, give us your examples. Yes. <laughs> we have to boil we have to boil the water before bathing because the water is very cold. Wait, we have to boil to boil the water or water before bathing. Before batting, because the water is cold. Okay, mm, that's not past perfect. We had to boil the water. So it should be, we had boiled the water mm -hmm. before taking a shower to take a as it was too cold. Yes. Okay. We had boiled the water before taking a shower as it, as it was too cold. That's that, that's the way it should be. Okay. Who is next, Joaquin? Jancy. Jancy. I had I had okay. put I had put the beans to boil 
when they began to smell burnt? I had put. I had, I had put yeah, the beans. The beans to boil. Mm -hmm. When they began to smell burnt. Like burn. Quemado? Yeah, burnt? like burnt. Uh -huh. yes. I had put the beans to boil when they yes. began to smell like burnt. Okay, let's go with negative statements. Who is next, Jancy? Um, Karen. Karen Rodriguez. Yeah. Karen Rodriguez. Okay, uh, negative. Mm -hmm. uh, he hadn't whistle out loud so i don't understand why dogs are following us uh, following us <laughs> hold on he hadn't whistled aloud aloud uh-huh so i don't understand why dogs are following us <laughs> Should it be I didn't or I don't? I in in which part? In the second part? Yeah, the second part should it be in past or present? I don't understand why dogs are following us. That's okay, actually. This is happening right now. Yeah. Head and whistle aloud, so I don't understand why dogs are following us. He had a whistle, weasel, weasel. 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 There you go, Karen. Weasel. Weasel. El weasel, decía mi suero. ¿Qué es el weasel? I can't remember. What is el, el weasel? In Salvadorian. Ah, uh, can't remember. I think it's like un hijo postizo or something like that. Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Karen, who is next? Uh, let me see, Rosa Maria. Rosemary. Hi. Okay, my example is I had chosen my favorite dress. Uh, the negative is I haven't chosen my favorite dress. And uh, in the road is have you chosen your favorite dress? I hadn't chosen my favorite dress. Had, had you chosen your favorite dress? You got it. That's true. I hadn't chosen my favorite dress when dad called me. Okay. Who is next? Let's go with questions. Daniela. Daniela. <laughs> Okay. This morning I have a question. Hmm. In question form. Ah, in question form. Mm -hmm. uh, had I had you had I Boil the water this morning? <laughs> yes. And I boiled the water this morning. To so take my shower. To take my shower. Okay. And I boiled the water this morning to take my shower. Okay. That's a valid <laughs> past perfect question. Okay. Who is next, Daniela? Um Jancy. Um, two times, okay. Um, I have put the beans. No, no, no. Oh, oh. You, you already gave okay. us an example, right? Yes. But it's okay. A question. No. When had my husband boiled the beans? Okay. When had my husband boil the the beans that could be a rhetoric question when had my husband boiled beans boiled beans it's just a rhetoric question 
When had my bo husband boiled wings? Cuando andado hirviendo este frijol de bar? Okay, guys. I have to leave you. I have another class after yours from okay. 9 to 10 p.m. Please practice okay. this, okay, during the weekend. Okay. I'll see you on Monday. Don't forget. Yes. Bye. Good see night. Have a nice weekend. Good night. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.